Putting hogs on the mob, planting purple seeds. Baltimore Ravens coat, purple trim, big body, old school for low. Purple rim, 77 cutty, black with the purple strip. What's good, Ravens fam? So, not surprised. Um, Per Aaron Wilson, Andy Isabella. Uh, he was released not too long ago from the uh, Cardinals. And I put out a little tweet um, saying, you know, Ravens is going to be interesting. I already knew it. Um, but, yeah, so I don't know what day I put that tweet out. But I put it on here so y'all can see. But, um, yeah, I already knew. Like, the Ravens going to be interested. Then Bateman, foot injury. Walked out of the uh, stadium with a foot cast. Yeah, I believe it's very serious. But, uh, and I'm like, Andy Isabella, let me look at his stats. Um, he's young. Didn't see anything. Like, didn't see anything. So I'm wondering, like, I know the Cardinals had Christian Kirk, obviously D Hop. You know, there was a shine. I can't think of who else they had at the time. Um, so I'm like, okay. And then this year, I'm like, they got Hollywood. And, uh, you know, D-Hop is out right now, but he's coming back. And I'm like, this dude ain't shine. Then they end up just releasing him. So y'all know me. I'm going to keep it 100. I'm like, okay. Like, I don't really, I don't really just, like, I'm not expecting anything. The dude is, and it's another short dude. Um, I believe he's 5'9". Let me just double check while I'm doing this. But, uh, yeah, 5'9". Uh, he's 25, so he's still young. But, yeah. Like, I can't remember when we were playing him in preseason. Was he the one that was cooking us in that little preseason? But, you know, it's preseason. But then again, we're getting, we're getting cooked in the record season somewhere. <laughs> um, yeah. So, yeah. When I saw that, I'm like, okay, whatever. But I'm like, y'all had Makai Polk. You know what I'm saying? Um, you let him go off the practice squad, uh, I believe for like a linebacker or something like the fifth, sixth linebacker, old person, um, somebody that, you know, no other teams want it. Um, it's, it's like, okay, like what, like what the heck? So we have what Makai Polk, um, Shamar Bridges and. You just let both of these young guys go. I know undrafted and everything. Now you need like a wide receiver and then you just going to get some dude just off the street, just the Ravens away. And it's like, I try my best to stay, you know, on the positive side of the front office, but they make it so hard. They make it so hard. It's like they're so stubborn. Like, would we have had these type of problems if, I don't know, you trade for a wide receiver, break your old 1996 rules, and get after it. It's a new day and age. Rich Ryan, this ain't your daddy's ravens. Like, I don't understand. I don't. Jalen Hurts, AJ, Devontae Smith, Kyler Murray, D Hop, Hollywood, freaking Burrow. Yeah, he got three of them. <laughs> it's just ridiculous. And then we look, I'm like, okay, baby's gonna be that dude. Then. He drops the ball three times, and he dropped multiple, multiple times every week. At first, I was like, okay, it's raining. It's raining. Nah, I can't use that no more. It's like, dude. 
And I'm I'm like, is they, you know, is he hurt hurt or is his confidence they gonna work on it? But to me, it's all the Ravens' fault. It is all the Ravens' fault. If they sit there and start passing like all everybody else, and then you know the run game is gonna be there no matter what. I wasn't even planning on doing this all on the video, but it's happening. But anyway, the run game is going to be there no matter what. And you have Lamar Jackson as your quarterback. Heck, when Flacco was the quarterback, the run game was still good. They didn't do They didn't help out Flacco like that. And then when Flacco actually had somebody good, and Quan Bowden and Torrey Smith, what happens? Torrey Smith, Eagles. Anquan, we got to let you go. Stupid. Oh, I just had to I just had to say that. But, yeah, so uh, Andy Isabella, he's a raven. Hit that like, hit the subscribe, hit the share. Tell me what you think. I'm just like, eh.